For this lesson, I'm going to review how to write fractions as decimals. So say that I have the fraction 5 eighths. I'm going to change it into a decimal using long division. So 5 divided by 8. Okay. Put up my decimal point. Okay. And 8 goes into 5 0 times. Add a 0 because I'm after the decimal point now. I'm to the right of the decimal point. 8 goes into 50 6 times. 6 times 8, 48. Subtract, you get 2. Bring down another 0. The goal is to get a remainder of 0. So 8 divides into 20 2 times. 2 times 8 is 16. Subtract, you get 4. Bring down another 0. 8 divides into 40, 5 times. Okay, subtract, and you get the remainder 0. So 5 eighths as a decimal is equal to 0 and 625 thousandths. Okay, now say I have a mixed number such as 2 and 3 fifths. Now there's two approaches to doing this. Okay, you could automatically put your whole number to the left of the decimal point and then solve 3 fifths as a decimal. Okay, so using the same process as we just did, okay, 5 goes into 3 zero times but into 30 6 times. 6 times 5 is 30 subtract, you get 0. So 0 and 6 tenths is 3 fifths as a decimal. So you can add that to the whole number that you already have. You can also change 2 and 3 fifths into an improper fraction. So 2 times 5 is 10 plus 3 is 13 over 5. And you can divide 13 by 5. 5 goes into 13 two times. Bring up the decimal point. 5 times 2 is 10. Subtract, you get 3. Bring down a 0. 5 divides into 30. 6 times. 6 times 5 is 30. Subtract, and you get a remainder of 0. So in both cases, you get that 2 and 3 fifths as a decimal is 2 and 6 tenths. And that is a review on changing fractions into decimals.